Hello to you on a cracking night here at the Theatre of Dreams, Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray, joined in the commentary position by Lee Dixon. And this is where it all starts in the UEFA Champions League. The group stage and match day one. My goodness, so much to look forward to. It is Manchester United facing Shakhtar Donetsk. Well, thank you, Derek. With being big favourites, complacency can be a problem. You've got to use that to your advantage if you're playing a home side as expected to go through. Can they put the pressure on in the first 20 minutes and hold out and then try and nick the game in the second half? chosen this particular shape. Rafael Varane plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. Marcus Rashford starts with Jadon Sancho out wide. And the main striker today is Edinson Cavani, the Uruguayan. This is the lineup for the visitors today. Well, as a team, Lee, they love to apply almost suffocating pressure. Based on the lineup, do you expect the same approach today? Yeah, I think so, Derek. It makes it really difficult for the opponents to find their rhythm unless their touch is absolutely perfect. It forces mistakes, so I'd expect we'll be seeing plenty of that from them today. Rashford. Paul Pogba. Sancho now, Cavani, Pogba, Bruno Fernandes, good use of the ball, but can they trouble the defence? Cavani, it looked as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Intense pressure. Dentinho. Dentinho has it. Tete. This is looking threatening. What can he do from here? Well, that's a splendid piece of challenging. Bruno Fernandes. Sancho now. Wan-Bissaka attending to his defensive chores. Tete. Now can they make something happen? It needs an accurate cross. Stepanenko. Timely intervention. And space to attack. Bruno Fernandes. Now Pogba. Just couldn't get it through. Splendid tackle. And the outcome is a corner here. Over it comes. Well, they haven't overcome all the difficulties. And it's in! Well, here's the replay, and there'll be a few accusing glances after that clearance. Giving away the ball there is criminal. And at this level, quite honestly, you get punished. The 
the opening goal of the game then. Goal for Manchester United. Number 19, Rafael Varane. Ismaili. It's with Matt Vienko. Stepanenko. Well, as you can see, United haven't had too much of the ball, but to their credit, they've been absolutely blistering on the counter-attack. They just sit back, hit you on the break, and it's really working for this team. He continues his run, and he's in. Ismaili. Will he play it in? Stepanenko. This looks promising. Stepanenko. Well, pass after pass, maybe they can chisel an opportunity. Oh, they've lost it. Cavani. And Rashford. Cavani. Well, the goal will not stand. It is offside. Yeah, good football there, but just straight offside. Well, they've jumped in front, Lee. That's the most important thing. Your assessment so far? been a decent half for United coach still has some work to do at half time though ball retention has to improve a little bit in the second half if they're going to dominate possession could be key it might be on for them good defending and that will do it for the first half here at the theatre of dreams I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, you're right. He has played well and goals win games. He's been a joy to watch in this form. Sit back and enjoy him in the second half. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. Manor Solomon. Solomon. Stepanenko. Solomon. A fine reading of the situation. Matvienko. Bruno Fernandes. It's with McTominay. Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. Ideal for the goal. Oh, the referee points to the spot. Penalty. Well, it had to be a penalty. And a booking part of the story as well. from the spot well let's have a look again it seems like an easy job to score from 12 yards out but I can tell you I've missed a few in my time I've scored a few mine Derek Second goal for them here.
The visitors have totally controlled possession. After that, it's been a little bit disappointing. Creativity in midfield is a little bit off. Certainly a too slow in front of goal. Need to get wide, need to get crosses in the box. It's there for him. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. Danger averted for now. Solomon. On the ball, Tara Stepanenko. And he read it superbly. Rashford. Edinson Cavani's in the vicinity. Solomon. Well, there might well be scope for them to counter attack here. Crossed in there. Retaining possession proving difficult. Giving the ball away. Ismaili. Solomon. Can they create something from here? Scott McTominay. Bruno Fernandes. Vital interception. The danger was very real. He needs to get rid of that fast. Just ten minutes to go. Well, they couldn't keep it. Bruno Fernandes, Cavani, oh nice ball over the top to chase, and now can he keep calm? Stepanenko, and the counter-attack is on, options available, looks as though they might make real progress on the counter-attack, not so. Oh, terrific piece of goalkeeping. Substitution for Manchester United. Coming off the pitch, number six, Paul Pogba. Here's a change for Manchester United. Number 17, Fred. Over it comes. And it all counts for naught. Rafael Varane. So full time it is, and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign. Well, it's everything you want from the start of match one. Good, strong start. That result will give everybody confidence, especially the players. Well done. Well, a strong contribution, as we've come to expect from Bruno Fernandes. Lee, interested to know what you made of his performance. Well, a really good performance from the lad today. He was pretty much involved in everything and he never really looked like missing his penalty, did he?